And it's gonna be current gen only. Oh. We have all been catfished. This is something I'm sure, I'm certain that you were not expecting. Or maybe you were. You let me know if you were expecting or not. So we had a massive leak about GTA 6 not long ago. And then just a couple of days ago, this is the new leak season for GTA 6. And it's good that we're getting some sort of information. Because that tells us that something is nice. It looks like that GTA 6 trailer is going to be happening this year. And it's very good to hear that, right? But these are all leaks. But check this out right just the other day we had this news that 50 cent is teasing gta 6 oh, shit. Oh, shit. but however that's not the case apparently 50 cent isn't connected to gta 6 but a tv series name vice city Bruh. yeah ladies and gentlemen this is apparently what's happening ladies and gentlemen i don't know about this <laughs> There's a good leak. I'll get to the good news for GTA 6. I'm not gonna be just making a video and give you the bad news. Yep, we have bad news, guys. But we also have good news right after. So stick around for that. And there's a video I wanna link you as well. But apparently, the situation here is that 50 Cent Vice City will be developed by Paramount, Paramount Plus. Bruh. Unfortunately, this revelation, which was delivered by Deadline, means that there is no further news on GTA 6 outside of the massive leaks that occurred last year. In Deadline's reveal, it was revealed and explained that Paramount Plus, Lionsgate Entertainment, and Paramount Television Studios are partnering with 50 Cent and his associated brands to flesh out all new project named Vice City. That's it, guys. This is what we're talking about. And man, this story has been ridiculous and... It kind of felt like that he was teasing his involvement and the part that is kind of suspect right now is that his TV show is gonna be in Miami It's gonna be called Vice City GTA 6 is Vice City apparently he's not gonna be in GTA 6 Maybe this TV show is gonna have a link with GTA 6 that we're not sure but apparently we also have the the direct quote at Vice City follows three friends and former soldiers who returned to their home city of Miami in the mid 80s after being dishonorably discharged. Obviously, you can pause the dream and uh, pause the, the, the video and you can read about the American dream yeah. and all that. But check this out. Apparently, Rockstar also dropped a new trailer. Oh, shit. Oh. Yeah, they did drop a new trailer, but not about GTA 6. Bruh. Not about GTA 6. You want to see what they dropped this for? Check this out. So, Rockstar Games came out and they dropped this. I cannot say this word on YouTube. Los Santos, and this is probably copyrighted. Los Santos Nesquik Wars reaches its eye-popping conclusion with an explosion of hallucination. Uh, cannot say that word on YouTube. And revenge in the last dose. It's coming on March 16. But guys, apparently the only news, the only news that's good in this situation is this, right? Just the other day, Test fun came out. I made a dedicated video on it. I'm not gonna go through it, but essentially we have Tom Henderson replying and responding to the situation. And we have really good news on what's happening with GTA 6. Surely these are the leakers, so do not believe everything you hear, but these are good leakers. They have been leaking stuff for a long, long time, especially Tom Henderson, very credible guy. He has leaked Call of Duty stuff, Battlefield 2042 stuff, and he was the guy that ended up leaking that Lucia Burna, you know what I'm saying, right? And and we all know that Lucia Bunda is gonna be taking 50 gigabytes whenever we get to see that in GTA 6, okay? Test fun says that the game deadline is set for holiday 2024, although it can be, you know, slip into early 2025. They're doing their best to not delay the game to 2025 holiday or holiday 2025 or 2026. They're cutting content from the game so they can put that out later on as DLCs. Tom Henderson, however, kind of disagrees. He agrees, but he disagrees. He says that, yeah, test is good, but uh, I think the game is going to be coming out by the end of 2025, and it's going to be current gen only. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's the biggest news right now because a lot of people are thinking that this game is going to be on PS4, myself included, because let's be real, that's where the money's at. And basically, they have been waiting all this long because they wanted to see PS5 sales be high, Xbox Series X sales be high, because they want to put this game on current gen consoles. WRL, and this also just happened. We ended up getting a new teaser for GTA 6. Click on this video on the screen, and I will see you right there. Check this out, guys, and I will see you right there.